Hey guys, welcome back or to the channel. Um, if you guys are new here, go ahead and hit that uh, subscribe button. Helps me out a lot. I'm trying to get to 4,000, 5,000 subscribers. But leave a comment, whatever. But just picked this up off of Marketplace for 100 bucks. So we're just gonna walk around it. <clears throat> Don't mind the cat. Obviously it needs a couple parts. Um, I know the guy said it needs a top end, but that was included in the price. Take all these. Last time it was registered, it looks like it was 2008. It's in pretty good condition, otherwise it needs a seat cover, obviously the little stuff. But, like I said, came with a uh, new top end, kit, key, everything, 100 bucks. So, let's get this in the garage and start taking the motor out, because I know it needs a top end, he said. But, um, other than that, we're gonna take all these stupid stickers off make it somewhat nice and see how it runs so stay tuned hold on okay got it in the garage let's take this uh <clears throat> thing off let's see how dirty this bastard is Can in in there. She's a bit dirty. Can in. <clears throat> I don't know, like, there's any gas in there, so that's good. So, <clears throat> she took the gas tank off and it's missing the pet cock, so that's always good to see. So, everything here looks pretty stock. Uh, no spark plug, but like I said, I, was no, I knew it needed a top end, but. Everything else is in pretty good shape other than it faded, but we'll fix that too. But let's get the top end off and we'll go from there. So as we all know, um, cylinder shop, piston shop, but we already knew that. But my main focus was on the crank. Um, to check them, you can have side to side play, but no up and down. So we are good on the crank area. So that's a plus. So yeah, all we really need is um, a top end kit, which he provided and then, um, couple more parts and then she'll be able to put her back together. So, hold on. But yeah, like I said, the, the car, brand new. I'm sure it's a Chinese knockoff, but still brand new. But yeah, let me uh, see what else I can find. All right. So, <clears throat> we're gonna get this thing prepped. The old top end gasket. What you really wanna do is just stuff a rag in there so you don't get any big chunks down there. Um, you can use a razor blade, get the big stuff off. Or I like using this. Oh. But yeah, this is pretty good. Job. You just don't want any big chunks down there. So yeah, what you try to do is get as clean as possible, which is like that. <clears throat> you want no like big chunks or anything in there. And then put the gaskets on and the cylinder. <clears throat> so make sure you got your piston rings on. Make sure the arrow is always pointing to the exhaust and says, unless it says otherwise, which it's always towards the exhaust. <clears throat> I like to lube it up with a little bit of two stroke oil first around the rings and stuff. So it has a little bit of lubrication before you put it on there. Yep. 
move up the cylinder walls too. Then attempt to put, there's tools you can buy for this to put the piston in, but that's just a waste of money. It's pretty easy to do. Just gotta squeeze them. Also make sure that the ring gaps are not in the same place. Make sure they're like far apart so they don't uh, come together. cylinder down so after you get the head head uh, cylinder bolts tight and stuff what I like to do is give a little a little gentle giant kick just to make sure everything running smooth which it is it's not hanging up anywhere and we're good I'm gonna put the rest of the stuff back back on make sure before you put the head on uh, inspect the head and stuff to make sure it's not all dinged up and stuff. Before we get too excited, let's see if this bad boy has spark. Didn't even check that, but put the key in. On. My luck, then I'm spark. I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah, it has spark. So that's good. I'm excited now. All right, so got the top end on. Um, got a new uh, pickcock for the gas tank. Let's see, she'll fire. Okay, uh, don't worry about the side clutch or the side cases, I should say. Um, I didn't put everything back together just in case it didn't run. Right even works. Awesome. Also, make sure you do a couple uh, heat cycles on it before you crazy with your little throttle. There. All right, well, this is the end of this video. Um, I'm gonna put it all together, get a seat cover, and then um, try to fix this up a little bit, looking nice, and then we'll go for a test drive. So stay tuned for the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. Remember, subscribe, like, comment. Bad and good, whatever, don't care. But yeah, $100 blaster with a free top end kit. I've put about 30 bucks into it so far, just for the pickcock and gas line and stuff like that but other than that it runs good all right see you guys on the next one so here it is running got a new seat cover all that stuff lights work Yeah. Not sure why it sounds like that. It ran pretty good. It sounds normal in person, but yep, subscribe guys.